we've seen an increase in income leads to an increase in demand. In symbols, we can say an increase in income leads to an increase in demand. We can also show the effect graphically. We started off with demand curve D and the increase in income leads to an increased demand and we can show that by a rightward shift of the demand curve. So, on account of the increase in income, demand curve D shifts to the right and we have demand curve D1. I want you to know that both of these demand curves satisfy the law of demand. Yes, the law of demand states that it's an inverse relationship between price and quantity demanded. There is decrease in price, it leads to an increase in quantity demanded. On this demand curve, if there's a decrease in price, we move from this point, say, to this point on the demand curve. Demand curve D1, yes, the same hold. If there's a decrease in price, it leads to an increase in quantity demanded. We move from this point, there's a decrease in price, increase in quantity demanded, to this point, a movement along the demand curve. But the difference between these two curves is that because of the high income, the demand on curve D1 is more than it was for D. For example, at price P1, this would be the level of demand on demand curve D. At the same price, you can see the demand is more. So the increase in income led to an increase in demand.